as we move down the path to signing a player, there's a whole bunch of people who are made aware so that they can prepare, whether it's the merchandising team to make sure we've got, I mean, enough L's or O's in, you know, Mario Balotelli in the shop because there was a huge demand. I, I read a stat the other day uh, that we sold £50,000 worth of Balotelli shirts on the day he signed. Um, so, you know, you've got to be geared up for that. You know, in the past, Liverpool had this situation where, you know, we'd have success or have an opportunity and not capitalise on it, and th those days are long gone. Because of the gaps between the clubs and between the, the, the leagues, almost all the time, OK, sometimes a little team can win a big team, but that is not the rule. That is the, the exception that confirms the rule. And is this the football we want? Is this the sport we want? Maybe. I'm not telling that I'm right and the, the, the other way is wrong, but what I wanted to listen about football, it is people to have the, the guts uh, to, to speak about this and to say, what is the kind of football we want? I'm not against funds. I'm against funds that nobody knows where is the money, nobody knows what they are doing, they try to manipulate football, and it is not good for, for sports that. So this is my opinion.